Kaya Wilkins, better known as OK Kaya, is a Norwegian-American musician and actress from New Jersey. Wilkinson was born in New Jersey and raised in Nesodhagen, I'm sorry for the pronunciation, four miles outside of Oslo. Raised by her mother, along with five brothers, she has both Scandinavian and African-American roots. That was one of the things that basically made up her whole childhood. Wilkins' first release as OK Kaya was the song Damn Gravity, which was released in 2015. Wilkinson released her first full-length album, Both, in 2018, and the album was recorded with her boyfriend, Aaron Main, of the band Porsches. In 2020, Wilkins released her second full-length album under the moniker OK Kaya, titled Watch This Liquid Pour Itself, in 2020, via, I'm sorry for the pronunciation, Jack Joar. The album received three out of five stars from The Guardian. She played her first acting role in Norwegian drama Delma. In August 2022, or 2020, Wilkins released her mixtape Surviving is the New Living. With a whole range of mixtapes and studio albums, singles and EPs, this artist is one of the biggest indie artists in the whole world as we speak. In an interview, she says that some of the artists that she was inspired by, and I quote, my influence are unspecified. Sometimes I feel like I'm trying to cup water because I don't know or care much for favorites. So answering these questions may be defeated, the purpose of actually getting to know me a little. But I remember living across the street from the IFC center around the same time I bought my guitar and started to write music. Going to the movies or sitting in Washington Square Park for hours, I did not have an iPod. I had sold it a few years prior to attend Roskill Festival. There was some music on my computer, Beth Carvalog versions of Danca de Salido, but not, uh, nothing else. OK Kaya's upbringing was pretty chill. She was raised in Nesodalken, a village outside of Oslo. Wilkins grew up with a brother who played in black metal bands and a mother who, whose record collection became the foundation of her musical education. Early on, she was more captivated by studying dance than making music. But that changed in her late teens when she moved to New York to work as a model. Her first songs, which she wrote on a guitar she got when she was 13, were musical diary entries that allowed her to explore the deepest thoughts with darkly witty lyrics and dedicated acoustics. She began releasing her music as OK Kaya in 2015, when the label Hot Charity issued the singles Damn Gravity and Clenched Teeth in 2017. She collaborated with the Danish producer Vera and the King Krul on the Oz track Slush Puppy. That year, she also appeared in the first film, Joachim Trier's Delma. The following year, OK Kaya's debut album both arrived on Wilkins' own heavy body label. She recorded the album in the Brooklyn home studio and produced it with Porsche's Iron Man. Both acclaims led Wilkins to sign with a Jaguar in 2019, a deal she commemorated with a velvety cover of Cher's Believe. For OK Kaya, Catholic second album's 2020s Watch the Liquid Pour Itself, Wilkins worked with co-producer Jacob Portrait and John Carroll Kirby. It took home Norway's Spellman Prize for Best Indie Alternative Album. That August, Jaguar issued the project mixtape Surviving is the New Living, co-produced by Wilkins and Nature Boy. It was followed by another mixtape, October 2021's The Incompatible OK Kaya. In the meantime, Wilkins moved to New York to Europe for various museum appearances and art exhibitions, including an installation that amplified music made underwater. While sheltering in place during the COVID-19 pandemic, she worked on OK Kaya's third album, which she wrote, performed, and engineered and produced in isolation using studio loaned by friends. It was partly inspired by undergoing ketamine therapy. She eventually finished the album after returning to New York and inviting friends to record finishing touches at Gaia Studio in Greenpoint, Brooklyn. Among the nearly, nearly 20 guests were Nikki Hakim, Dean Spencer, Eram Green, Taja Cheek, and Norwegian compatriot Faro Kari Jahansen. With Wilkins making an admittedly abstract comparison between certain 
well possesses of humans and trees the resulting sap arrived in jaguar in november 2022 okay kai is definitely a big artist in the alternative industry but also Okikaya has revolutionized the whole industry, not only being one of the first women trying to make music a bit different than everyone else, but also furthering the boundaries of how music can be created and how much effort it, it takes. Also being an indie artist now with her own record label, things are just gonna head in new directions for her. So let's hope she will put out more music that will get the audience going to create themselves.